After a scintillating loop debut last Saturday, Bright Acuity wanted an encore four days later. He also wanted it to be extra special, since the Cameroonian student athlete was celebrating his 22nd birthday. However, his celebration fell flat on the University of the Philippines Fighting Maroons date with Katipian and neighbors Ateneo de Manila University Blue Eagles. And after the game, he was in no mood to celebrate. I really don't know what to say. It was a good fight, and they wanted it more. A dumbfounded Akuity Express. I am the first half of the game, the Blue Eagles and the Fighting Maroons figured in a dogfight. But the championship experience of the Blue Eagles showed in the second half, as they led by as much as 13 points early in the final frame. Even if coach Bo Parasol tried to fire up his troops, the Fighting Maroons were simply overwhelmed in the end, only managing to cut the lead to as low as five points. For his part, the six foot seven big man wanted to take charge for the Fighting Marins, even trying to throw down a jam over William Navarro as Ateneo made their run. I just felt I wanted to do something to charge up my teammates. Saying, it didn't go in, recalled Akuity, who tallied 11 rebounds, 9 assists, and 8 points on 4 of 10 shooting. However, if there was one glaring stat that drew the ire of the UP fans in attendance, it was the free throw discrepancy. The Blue Eagles attempted 31 freebies compared to just 7 charities for the Fighting Maroons, none in the first half. Acuity did not delve into this, just wanting to move on from this loss. We barely attacked the paint, straight up, I'm shooting threes, he added, as he was forced to even throw an attempt from downtown. For Coach Bo, that shows you how much he got our backs. It can happen to anyone. It's still part of the game. Not even with a few hours left for his birthday, Akuity is not planning any big celebration. It's party time, back to the gym for us.